Hi Capricorn, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do your reading from now until the end of October. I do apologize on the delay, things have been extremely crazy, but I'm doing the best that I can, so thank you for your patience. Um, this is for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Uh, this uh, reading is not for everybody, okay? It's for somebody, but not everybody. There's some hidden forces at this time, okay? Something is going on behind the scenes. Something's cooking, all right? Something mysterious, unknown, is going on behind the scenes. Okay, so I don't know what it is, but something's going on. My goodness. could cause you some delays. May need you may need to have some strength to get what up through whatever this is. May make you stronger, right? Uh, may make you feel emotional. May cause you to uh, withdraw or it may even make you cry, whatever this is. I'm just being honest with you here, okay? Because something is going to may cause a shutdown, emotional shutdown of some sort. Mm, loss. You may experience some sort of loss that hurts. I mean, that's reality, right? Something that may feel a little overwhelming. Okay, this is the Ten of Wands. You may feel some sort of overwhelming loss. Okay, I'm sorry to tell you. Okay, there's something happening here that... It may even cost you some money. It could be a financial loss with these two things. Okay, it could be financial. It's not going to make you happy. It's going to it's like going to be cause some dissatisfaction in your life, whatever it is. It's too much. You may feel like this is a little bit too much. But there's a better opportunity for you if you could just see it behind you. You know, turn around and look in a different direction, you would see that there's a there's a there's full potential. Full potential. But whatever is, is, is happening may cause some sort of heaviness within you. It's gonna, it could be a financial loss, okay? Whatever this is, it definitely could be like money is being burnt, thrown away, uh, whatever. Whatever this is, it may cause um, financial burden okay because this is a card of burden so it may cause financial burden but it's changing your course okay it's changing your path for the better you may not see it that way because you know you guys don't like to spend your money right you are very uh thrifty but it feels as though, you know, you, you, you're, you may have to cough up some money for something. And it's going to be a very positive outcome, even though you may not like it at the time. Okay? Just, just saying. It's going to be a positive outcome. Maybe something needed to go, and you've been putting it off, putting it off, putting it off. And now you can't put it off anymore. Okay, just saying. Um, a change is needed. So there is going to be, there's a change on the horizon. Okay, there absolutely is. There's some sort of destined change on the horizon for you, Capricorn. And it's going to bring you a better opportunity. So look at it like that. It's going to take you out of this period of stagnation that you've been if you've been procrastinating with something well 
that's probably not going to happen for very much longer. Okay, so what is this strength card? You could be dealing with a Leo. We also have uh, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, which is you. Libra, or not Libra, uh, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Whatever this is, is it's going to cause you some dissatisfaction and you're not going to feel, it's going to um, make you feel ungrateful, you know, as far as finances go. You're going to be like, oh my God, this is ridiculous. So, yeah, there's some sort of cycle that needs to be completed in your life or there's some sort of situation that needs to be dealt with that you haven't been dealing with and it's time. It is absolutely time. It's time for you to have something new or whatever it is. is there's a new beginning that is needed or a new thing or something needs to be replaced or... Something is about to be revealed. Okay, there's going to be a, this uh, truthfully. Okay, with this card and this re card, there's going to be some sort of revelation or secret or truth or breakdown. Okay, that comes about that pushes you in a new direction, whether you like it or not, and it's going to cost you some money, I think, and you probably aren't going to like it. Whatever this is. You know, I don't know. I don't know what this is. But maybe you could be dealing with a woman that is keeping secrets. Ooh. And you, I mean, this could be you if you're a woman and you see right through this woman. Just saying. Because you look at, you're looking. This is you. Could be a man or a woman. But this is you. Looking. You could be looking inside for your strength as well. Because this is the strength card. You may need to look inside for your strength. Whenever this truth or situation comes about. You may need some strength. To deal with some sort of you may this is you know the world card in reverse is like emptiness it's incomplete something is incomplete or there's a feeling of emptiness something has been making you feel incomplete okay you're empty inside this is empty inside as well so you you've been feeling some sort of emptiness and it feels like you may know it Okay, because this is an inner knowing. It looks like she knows. This this is you, man or a woman, really. I mean, it's a woman, especially if you're a woman. So There's a woman in this predicament that knows something. She knows something. That... Sh that she has to defend herself you may have to defend yourself you may have to defend yourself you may put your guard up you may have some people that are against you Capricorn people may be criticizing you for some reason oh yeah they, there's judgment being passed on you for sure for sure but this is truth being revealed again. So something is going to come to light. You see the light? Something is going to come to light, Capricorn. There's going to be some sort of truth, revelation, secret, something with the moon, the judgment, the high priestess, the reverse. I'm telling you what. So there's going to be some sort of truth that comes out. And you're, you already, I think you already know what this is. But you're going to need to find the strength to deal with it. Oh my goodness. Now this is a card of karma as well. The judgment card is a card of karma. And this is destiny. So destined change is on the horizon. And I think you know it. Somebody's been lying. Somebody hasn't been telling the truth. 
you are dealing and you're gonna you're probably gonna stand up for yourself because somebody's been lying to you okay there's been some dishonesty here and the truth is absolutely positively going to come out if not by the end of this month by the beginning of November because something is going to happen and it is not going to make you happy upright this is extreme happiness it's not going to make you happy at all because the, you know change happens when there's no growth in a situation things have been stalled delayed the universe or, the, or whatever something's been cooking for a while right they see that there's been no forward movement they see that somebody's been in an unhappy situation things have been going downhill and the time is now for action to be taken. Something is going to happen very, very quickly. And it's going to bring balance to your life. It's exactly what you deserve. Believe it or not. And this is this is a card of karma as well. Because it, it's really like the justice card in the in the major in the major arcana there's some sort of karmic situation here in which somebody in this dynamic is going to get what they deserve because it's connected to this judgment card and it's destiny whatever is happening is going to bring balance to your life in the long term but you may not see it when it happens okay when it happens it may cause some emotional upset Okay, with that page of cups, you may not be happy. I see that you're not going to be happy about it. Whatever it is. Ooh. But it's going to bring about a new beginning here. A major new beginning. It is. You have a lot of majors here. This is a, this is a completion of one cycle and a beginning of a new one. It's like you guys are going to about to embark on a whole new journey, going down a whole new path. There's a change of course on the horizon that's probably going to be uncomfortable. It's an uncomfortable change of course. But there is a new beginning here. Where the baggage is left behind. So some something is being left behind because the fool doesn't take much with him on his new beginning. So something is being left behind. And you're going to learn some new skills, okay? You're going to learn some new tricks along the way. And in the end, it is going to make you very happy. I think there, and this is a completion card, there could be a completion of one, it could be a relationship. I'm just, I'm being honest with you. There could be, the, this is a completion card, it is. It could be the, uh, the end of a relationship, and it hurts, and it leads you in a new direction towards a new one. It could, okay? Now, this could also be adding to the family, okay? So you could be having a baby. A change in your family dynamics, okay? There's, there is. There's a big change. There's a completion of one cycle. This is a cycle. And a beginning of a new one. It could be, could go several ways, you know, because we got hundreds and thousands of people that watch these readings. So it's not going to, it's going to be different for every person. Somebody in this reading is ending a relationship. They are. They are. There's been stagnation. There's been some lies. There's been some dishonesty. Somebody knows that's the case. And the truth is about to be revealed. And it's going to bring somebody down a new path. Period. For somebody, there's an addition to the family. And the family dynamic changes. And there's a new beginning in the family. This definitely, I think, involves children. Okay, there's children in the mix here. Um, the memories are going to, there's going to be memories that come up, memories of the past.
and there's gonna be some there's gonna be some some kind of overwhelming feeling shake up disharmony in your life there's something coming I'm sorry something is coming that is going to shake you up and it may have to do with children it may have to do with a past lover it may have to do with a family your family your parents it may bring you back to your childhood memories Whatever this is, it's something is going to be revealed that or something is going to happen that changes your course for the better. It is going to change your course for the better, but in the immediate, you know, in the middle of it, at the beginning of it, it's not going to feel like that. Okay, it's going to feel like it's a loss. But this loss is going to bring you good fortune. It's destined to happen at this time for a reason. It is. Because it's time for you to evolve. This is, you need to evolve, but you haven't. Okay, so there's, it's gonna, it's gonna bring you a passionate new beginning. Something that does have growth. Exciting. There's an exciting new beginning here. That is, it's destiny. <laughs> this is destiny, okay? So there's an exciting new beginning starting. After an upset. Okay, you can't you can't deny that. There's absolutely going to be an upset of some sort. There is. There is. Okay? There's going to be an upset. It's gonna, it's gonna, you're gonna have to find your strength and your courage and the whole nine yards, your willpower, your whatever, to deal with it as, with as much composure as you can. Because I feel like there's going to be some sort of revelation, truth, epiphany, wake up call, whatever it is, that shakes up your foundation. And cause it, this is a loss. This is an emotional loss. And this one is too. They both are. So there's going to be some sort of emotional loss that brings you something better. Now this Ace of Wands, that's a, that's a, Eruption. You see the eruption, the volcano is erupting. I just happened to notice that. Yeah, there is gonna there is gonna be some sort of eruption, but this eruption is going to bring something so much better. It really is. There's gonna it's gonna bring you something more practical. more genuine, real, something more real. It may ask you to find your backbone to head in a new direction. Whatever this is, whatever this is, it's it's like starting at the beginning again. You're, it's like it's going to bring you back to the beginning. Starting from square one. But you've been reluctant to move on and go down that new path. And that's why the time is now. It's like you've been reluctant. You've been holding on to something. Losing passion. Losing excitement. Growing resentful. Refusing to cross that bridge. Fear of change, fear of the unknown, thinking about it though, I think that you guys have been in a discontent situation, contemplating what, what's next, what am I going to accept, what do I want in love, 
there's been a there's been a lot of thought into who what when and where right and you're probably you've grown bored you've grown bored and unhappy wanting more wherever you're at it's like this, this has got to be more to life than this right so i feel like right now you're you're in a period you've been looking for more and you've been thinking about that love you've been thinking about love a lot And now you're probably in a foundation or you're in a situation, could be a relationship that is stagnant, troublesome. There's fighting, walking on eggshells with that seven of wands. It's like you're always having to defend yourself. And you're at a point where you're like, I can't take this anymore. Something like that. And the universe is, it sees it, hears it, sees the whole thing. Okay. And I feel like there's going to be some sort of, it could be a fight with that seven of wands. It could be a simple fight that brings about some, brings out some truth that moves you in a new direction. So be prepared for a, some sort of eruption, okay? You see the volcanoes erupting. Some sort of eruption that brings you down, brings you a passionate new beginning in love. So, Capricorn, that's pretty good, huh? It's not really, right? You're probably like, oh my God. But, you know, when, when things fall apart, it happens for a reason. I mean, that Wheel of Fortune is a destiny card. It's a card of purpose. Whatever is happening is bringing you closer to your life's purpose. It's changing your course for the better. That's what the Wheel of Fortune card means. Okay? Somebody's been in a situation where there's no growth, there's fighting, there's arguing, there's secrets... And it looks like the secrets are about to be revealed through probably some sort of fight. I don't know. Full moon's coming right up, and the full moon can do. You never know what's going to happen. So be prepared around this full moon. It could certainly be some sort of event that changes your life. Woo! Forgiving and learning. <laughs> That's a good one. As you release and heal the past, you experience more love in your present moments. It's a fantastic card for this reading. Separation. Time apart from your partner is on the horizon. I mean, one, I don't know. Like I said, this reading don't, will not resonate for every person. It's for somebody. It's for somebody. Not everybody. Now, the Ace of Cups. The Ace of Cups. Pay attention to your dreams. Pay attention to your dreams. Because your dreams could be telling you something at this time. Now the Ace of Cups is also like heaven sent, okay? It's heaven sent. So somebody from heaven could be guiding you, okay? Just keep that in mind. The heart of the matter. There is more going on than meets the eye. Recognize what this is all about. What is this about? This could be about somebody leaving your life. That's what this is about. And this doesn't, somebody leaving your life, it doesn't have to be a lover. This could be anybody. 
this could be anybody leaving your life. Just I don't know where that came from. I'm just saying. With this, with this full moon, with the moon card being the first card, I think there's going to be some sort of shift or change of course that changes your life. And it may not be easy. It may cause some sort of tears. But it's going to bring you good fortune and good luck and love and excitement and something really, really good in the long run. A lot of fertility, growth, excitement, expansion, adventure, new beginnings, okay? You have a new beginning here. And it's a big one. Big, 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 big one. And it's what you deserve at this time. So when this eruption happens, remember that you're going to come out on top. And you're going to receive a new partnership or a new beginning that is more passionate than where you are at. Good luck.